UCCI Pandemics, Dream Chasers, and Centerpoint Dance Studio. The highly anticipated boat parade brought to you by Cayman National, Bogle Insurance, CTMH Doctors Hospital, Pro Yacht, Cayman Bay, and Brick Cay. Hosted by Dane Ramon and Taylor Vaughn from 94.9 Bob FM. The best fireworks display of the year. What's Christmas without it? Let's start the show. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2019 Cayman National Parade of Lights. Welcome everyone to Kamana Bay. We're so excited to see you out here and what a wonderful night for this. My name is Taylor Vaughn from Bob FM. My lovely co-host, Dane. Absolutely, and my name is Dane from Bob FM also. I think we can make a little bit more noise than that. Let's get everybody we to make some more you. noise here. All that Christmas spirit is in the air. The boats are ready. Dane and I are so excited to be your hosts for the evening. We have so much in store for you. Lots of great performances. We've got fireworks. If you haven't checked out all the market slots yet, please go and walk around and see them. And if you've got kids here or if you're just a big kid yourself, Santa Slay is over near uh, Cayman National waiting for you to take pictures. Definitely, and uh, we're so excited. It's like I was telling Taylor earlier, this is actually my first time to the Parade of Lights. I've never been here before. Dang, you're born and raised in Cayman, and you've never been? Never, never experienced it before. But we got some exciting things to do. We're going to introduce our judges very soon. Is that correct? We sure are. I think we should uh, welcome some of our judges right now. First off, we'd like to welcome Sherry Welcome. She is the Cayman National Bank Marketing and Communications Manager. Hello, beautiful. Why don't you come in between us? There, yeah. Give Sherry a round of applause, please. So, Sherry, we want to first off say thank you so much to Cayman National for being our title sponsor for this, for this wonderful event. Yes. Um, we are so excited to partner with Hurley's Media on this awesome event. Um, we're happy to kickstart the Christmas season with beautiful boat parade, fireworks. I'm so excited. And it's a 45 years that Cayman National has now been around. So what, a be what better way than to celebrate than doing a big parade, right? Exactly. All right, welcome, and thank you so much. If you want to have your seat at the judges' table, we'll welcome our next judge. Most definitely. This one, he doesn't need any introduction. You can hear him on Irie FM. He's one of the hosts of a popular morning show here. Please make some noise for Craig Jervis. Craigie Boo is what we call him, Craigie. too, right? What, what? What? Look at this Christmas getup you've got on. Can you feel it, Cher? I can feel it radiating from you. There we go. That was the intention. Well, we've got it, don't we, Dane? Don't we? So uh, tell us a little bit, what, what you got coming up on morning show on Monday? Uh, definitely a recap of the Cayman National Parade of Lights. I'm excited and I haven't seen any boats just yet. Well, we don't want you to see them just yet. That's the whole, that's the whole deal. I'm ready. I'm ready. All right. All right. Well, you go sit down, uh, you know, do your stretches and get ready, and then we'll, we'll uh, come to you in just a little bit, okay? Sounds great. Awesome. Give him a round of applause, please. Well dressed, too. Great outfit. Now, I'm going to have you introduce our next guest. Well, this is another man who absolutely needs no introduction at all. You see him running around Kamada Bay all the time. The man who brought the cooler, because that's the most important job of the night. Ladies and gentlemen, from Karu and Abacus, right here in Kamada Bay, please welcome Marquez. <laughs> Marquez, are you, have you, you haven't judged before, have you? Yes, I think it's the third year in a row. The third year in a row. So you're the expert on this panel then. I am, and I'm happy to work with these two people together because it's a CMB night. It is. Yes, it is. All right, so last year, yeah. um, what do you want to see the boats do different from last year that this year? I think it's everything about the effort, the time of detail goes into the boat, colorful uniqueness, and making something special. I completely agree with that. And... Are you uh, ready to do this? Are you all uh, juiced up? You got your Christmas spirits flowing in every, in, in every ounce of your body and you're ready. Yes, I am. And we are all together, right? We are. It's, we're one big there happy family tonight here in Kamana Bay. And we're so excited to have you here. Um, Marcus, if you want to join your lovely fellow judges, we would love that. Most definitely. Let's give the judges a round of applause again, please. They got a very difficult job. We have 11 boats that's competing this year. So let's give all the boat owners a round of applause. They're on the waters, and we want to make sure they feel special. So let's do a round of applause, please. One big round of applause from the boats. Yes. Uh, of course, we do want to thank some of our sponsors because none of this is possible without them. 
All right, so we're going to start off, of course, a very important sponsor here, our title sponsor, and they deserve a loud round of applause for this one. Please give it up for Cayman National Bank. They're our title sponsor tonight. All right. Thank you guys so much. And obviously, we have to thank Kamana Bay letting us use their harbor, being here in the lovely decorated Kamana Bay with the big tree behind us. Also, our Marshall sponsor, and they'll be keeping the check in all the boats in the water today. Can you please give a round of applause for Pro Yacht? Right. And another one of our major sponsors, Bogo Insurance Brokers. Thank you so much for coming on board. We're lucky to have you. All right, and please give them a round of applause for CT8MH Doctors Hospital. They're also a major sponsor. Please give them a round of applause. And I think one thing we do as a beautiful island nation, better than anyone else in the world, are our fireworks. Do you guys agree with me on that? The fireworks in Cayman are none other. Who's ready for the fireworks tonight? Let's give a big round of applause to Britt K for helping us out and uh, bringing us the fireworks. So excited for those later on this evening. Most definitely. Now, the next segment that we're about to throw it to is a very exciting one. I've seen these guys perform before. They do an amazing job. Taylor, I'm going to give you the honor to introduce these guys. I get to do this? You, you have sure? to do this. It's wonderful. I'm very excited to do this. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, we want your attention to go to the stage because we want to welcome First Baptist Choir.
softly the world I sleeping heaven bent to earth below Christmas morning children waking to hear the sacred story told joy to First Baptist Church this Friday or this Sunday at 7 p.m. And we've got plenty more. So come on down.
your Savior lay. They found him in a manger where rocks and feet on hay. His mother Mary kneeling down unto the Lord in pray. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy.
Let's give a big round of applause to First Baptist Choir. Let's hear it again for their beautiful, beautiful vocal stylings. Amazing, man. I always, like I said, I always look forward to hearing these guys sing. They've been here numerous amount of times. And you, you can tell by the crowd, they love them. Please, as they make their way off stage, just please give them a round of applause again. Just honor them as they walk off, man. It's remarkable. I mean, Great job. I can't do that. Could you sing like that? No, nah, you don't want me to try to sing Yeah, here. no, we don't. That won't happen. But I, I will tell you this. They make it seem right now. For a while, I was wondering, when is that Christmas feeling going to kick in? Like, when are you going to start feeling like it's Christmas? And it's here. It's you can here. feel it right now. We've got the Christmas breeze. We've got the beautiful Kamana Bay Christmas tree. We've got all these amazing people here to watch the Cayman National Parade of Lights. Absolutely. Can you give a round of applause for Kamana Bay for making this feel like Christmas here tonight? We also want to give a big round of applause to the RCIPS Marine Unit. They're patrolling the harbor, making sure all the boats are safe in and out of here, and making sure we have a wonderful show as well. And, of course, this night would not be possible at all without our title sponsor. So let's give them a round of applause again. Cayman National Bank. You can visit right here in Kamana Bay. And if you're heading down that way, uh, don't forget, Santa Slate is there. If you have not seen it, it is uh, it's stunning. There's no other words. It's actually breathtaking. And there's photo ops down there waiting for you. If you want to take the kids or if you're just a big kid yourself, I think I might go hit. Should we go hit that up a little later? Absolutely. And please, parents, take your kids of Market Street. She's just down there by, by Cayman National Bank. It's beautiful. It so is. please take them down there. Also, there are two other photo opportunities for you. We've got the photo booth from Cayman National. They've got a big igloo that is uh, just past Agua and the CTMH Doctors Hospital photo booth, which is near King's Head. So definitely do that as well. It is a night to remember here in Cayman Bay. The Christmas breeze is blowing. The lights are on and we're getting ready for the boat. Dane, this is your first time. We're just starting. What do you think so far? Beautiful. I, I, this is speechless. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I feel like everybody's here. There are visitors here. There are people that's been here a long time. It's their fifth year. So they're enjoying it. It's great. I agree. I've done this every year since I've been here. I've been at uh, the Parade of Lights and so excited to be a host. Now let's bring on our next performance group. You guys give a warm welcome to UCCI Pandemics.
Let's give a big round of applause for UCCI Pandemics.
All right, one big round of applause one more time for UCCI Pandemics. Thank you guys so much for all that lovely music. I uh, had a great time dancing to that. My name is Taylor, and I'm excited to be your host for the evening. And my co-host is done with some lovely guests. Dane, who are you with right now? Oh, man, my job just got a whole lot easier. I'm surrounded by beautiful women that are doing great things for our island here, and I'm happy to introduce them. But before we do that, can we just get a round of applause again for UCCI? They're packing their stuff off stage now. They did a wonderful job. The first guest I'm going to introduce is Shari Welcome, the marketing manager of Cayman National Bank. Now, all three of you individuals have boots here in Kamana Bay. So I want you to, in, you know, in less than a minute each, or even more, sell what your boot is doing here. Because we know about Cayman National Bank, but there might be something that you're doing at your boot that we just don't know about. So at our booth tonight, we're giving away our 2020 calendar. It has become a keepsake in the community. So we encourage you to go on down to our, um, right in front of the Cayman National Bank um, branch and grab a calendar. I love the calendar because you guys usually highlight a lot of important information on that. So everybody usually goes out and grab those calendars. They are here. Did you guys bring enough? Yes, we, we should have enough. But if we don't, we do have them available at all of our branches on Monday. So if you don't get one tonight, you can go to any of our branches and they'll be available. Perfect, man. Uh, I was just reading something in the, uh, the article there for Cayman National Bank saying that you guys in the senior management team is mostly women. Can you give a round of applause for Cayman National Bank for endorsing women? That's beautiful, right? All right, so moving on to Big Brother's Big Sister, Shawnee is here. Shawnee, now you have a boot here, and it's a wonderful setup, and you guys do an excellent mentoring job here on the island. So much different things that we don't know about. Can you tell us about your boot, please? Absolutely. We have a beautiful booth um, as part of the Cayman National setup just before Santa's sleigh. And we have a fantastic Christmas tree there as well. And we have some fantastic purple Big Brother Big Sister Cayman Island ornaments that are um, so beautiful. Your tree needs this for this year. And we're asking for a donation. If you have coins, fantastic. We prefer notes, but we also have a very fun whirl-a-wish. You put your coins in and it does a beautiful spin. And um, yeah, we just really love people to come down. We have some of our fantastic bigs and littles there as well. Thank you guys for coming. So if you're interested in hearing more about the program, come and have a chat with them, come and have a chat with us. We've been going for 25 years in the Cayman Islands and we have you know, a huge program. We have some littles who are waiting to match with their big right now. And every penny helps make that Christmas wish a reality. And, and please go and check that boot out. It's very important that we play mentor to mentors to our young children here on this island. It's what they see, they idolize, and we want to make sure they see the right things, right? So thank you so much, Shawnee, for being out here. Go to the boot, dress the Christmas tree up. They got some of those. Oh, put it up to the camera again. It looks wonderful, right? And um, no stranger to the radio waves and no stranger to the public. You have a very difficult job, Jennifer, as the Cayman Islands Cancer Society, and you guys do such wonderful work, but it's very difficult on you too and that's why I, I see you being this very cheerful person every time I see you, you, you you're not even putting that on that's you but there's some important questions I want to ask you Jennifer about the Cayman Islands Cancer Society where exactly if they want to go to your boot tonight and they want to donate money because that can happen tonight and this is a, for an excellent cause where does that money go to Jennifer thank you for all the nice things that you said Wow, I appreciate that. You know, um, like Big Brothers Big Sisters, the Cancer Society has been around for 25 years. And it's on the backs of a lot of people in this community who have worked hard to build that organization and the community who supported it. But what do we, use for, what do, we do with the money? Um, we use the money locally to help the people who need it the most. It's the people who have cancer and their families. Yeah, and this is a really big time for us right now. We're so excited to be here tonight. It feels like the start of Christmas. We're so grateful to CNB that they've allowed us to come. We have a booth, and if people want to register for Stride, uh, Stride is our big event that's at the end of January. It's our biggest fundraiser of the year, and we want to break a record and have 2,000 people there this year. So if you want to come down to this, the CNB tent, we're in front of CNB uh, down there, uh, look for Vicki at the Cancer Society booth and she'll hook you up with um, registration for Stride. Or if you want to just stop by and make a donation and help us help others, that'd be great too. 
can we just one more time give these wonderful women of cause a round of applause, please? And also, just for being here, and go and check their boot out, too. It's by the market, and we want you to be active and to see it also. And, of course, we're going to continue the events tonight. We're here for Parade of Lights, and we're also to donate our time to different um, charities here on this island, and we want to make sure that happens. We're going to take things back to the main stage right now with my co-host, which I'm lucky to have, Taylor. She has a very special group who she's going to be introducing right now. Oh, look at now I can see you guys. How y'all doing? That was really weak, you guys. We're supposed to be in the Christmas spirit. Everyone's supposed to be happy. It's Cayman National Parade of Lights. There's so much going on here in Kamata Bay. So let me hear it. Are you guys having fun? There we go. I got to tell you, this side beat you guys. Should we try and even it out? Should we try one more time? Is everyone having a good time? This little guy in the front saying no. Did you go see Santa Slay? Would that put you in a better mood? To have mom take you over there. We once again want to thank our uh, title sponsor, Cayman National. We could not do this with all, all of our sponsors. Kamana Bay for giving us this beautiful venue. Uh, the RCIPS Marine Unit for patrolling the harbor. Of course, Pro Yacht, who is our Marshall sponsor. Bogle Insurance Brokers. Uh, CTHM Doctors Hospital, who is our photo booth sponsor. So you can go get your photo in their photo booth. Plus, Cayman National has the one as well. And Britt Kay, who's going to be bringing on those fireworks later on this evening. Who's ready for fireworks? Yeah, we're getting so close to getting those boats all lit up. But before we do that, we want to give you another amazing performance. This time, we're going to dance our booties off. So are you guys excited for that? I want to see you all dance along as well, right? Let's give a big, warm welcome to Dream Chasers. All right, let's hear for Dream Chasers. So 
So, Dane, did you have time to go check out that Christmas market yet? I did. I, well, Ashley, I'm going to check it out very soon. You know what? Let's, I'll, I'll stand right here. You stand right over there. I'm going to go over I here. I know there's a lot of people here. Can we get some noise in here, please? I feel Can we like get some more noise? really quiet. It's Christmas season. You know what? I was just told a couple minutes ago, like a special alert that's going to be happening. We're going to give away some money to the craziest person in the audience that makes the most noise. So when I count down from five, four, three, two, one, you got to do work. Come on, more than that. By the way, uh, that was a bold-faced lie. I just know that you guys need some coffee or get some drinks or something. Your kids have way too much energy. The parents are, like, standing around like, hey, what's going on? I know, right? So Everyone's I wanted to like, test well, I want money for Christmas. I know, right? All righty, guys, let's bring up our next act. Are you ready for another performance? All right, there we go. Let's welcome Centerpoint Dance Studio. Make some noise, please. Just hear those sleigh bells jingling, ring, ting, tingling too. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Outside the snow is falling and friends are calling you. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, let's go. Let's look at the show. Riding in a wonderland of snow Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, it's grand Just holding your hand We're gliding along with the song of a weathery fairy land Our cheeks are nice and rosy and comfy cozy are we We're snuggled up together like two birds of a feather would be Let's take that road before us and sing a chorus or two. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. There's a birthday party at the home of Farmer Gray. It'll be the perfect ending of a perfect day. We'll be singing the songs we love to sing without a single stop. At the fireplace where we watch the chestnuts pop. Pop, pop, pop. There's a happy feeling nothing in the world can buy. When they pass around the coffee and the pumpkin pie. It'll nearly be like a picture print by Courier and Ives. These wonderful things are the things we remember all through our lives. I just hear those sleigh bells jingling, ring, ting, jingling, too. Jing, jing, jing. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Jing, jing, jing. Let's take that road before us and sing a chorus or two. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Jing, 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 jing. Give him a round of applause, please. That's beautiful, man. I love those guys. Are you guys feeling the Christmas spirit? Is everybody alive here? Did you, guys, did you guys know that Dane tried out to be, uh, he wanted to be in the Centerpoint Dance Studio performance. He wanted to wear one of those dresses, but Absolutely. he just couldn't cut it. He didn't have the moves. Matter of fact, do you want to see me do the dance right now? Because I had the whole routine yeah, planned out. Yeah, let's do it. Do it, Dane. Do you it. You got to cheer me on. That's the only <laughs> way I'm going to do that.
Is that going to happen? <laughs> no. That's not going to take place. Trust me, you don't want to see that. Trust we're having me. a great time here, Taylor, so far, and we have wonderful things to talk about soon because we're here for Parade of Lights. We are. Cayman National, thank you again for being our title sponsor for this. Thank you to DJ Mars, who's going to be playing the tunes for us. Um, after everything is said and done, we're going to let you guys do some dancing and having a good old time, enjoying the Christmas spirit and this gorgeous Christmas breeze that's here, right? And we definitely want you to take time to go and see the market by Cayman National Bank. There is a sled that's there, a real Santa sled. It's a great time for you to take pictures with the kids. Check out the photo booths, take some pictures, and capture the memories here in Commander Bay because it's a beautiful setting and they're doing a great job. Santa said we could use it for tonight, so we have it on special loan. Most definitely. There's one thing that we're going to do very soon while we introduce DJ Mars that's coming out very soon, but we need help. We do. We're going to need help in order to this, for this to happen, okay? We're, we're here for the boats, right? We're here to see this amazing light show on the water, right? If you look down there, you can see the boats. They're not quite lit up. I think we need to get them in the spirit. We need to give them a countdown. You guys want to help us with that? Absolutely. I've spoken to every single one of the captains on the boat, and the only way they can hear in order to turn the lights on is for every single person in here is to scream out of control. Can you guys do that for me? Can we do that? All righty. Let's do it, guys. Help us count down from 10, 9, nine eight, 8, 7, seven 6, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, two 1. Light them up. Beautiful. All righty, guys. Look at these amazing lights. Check out these boats. We've got 11 boats in our parade this year. We've got three lovely judges down here, Marcus, Craggy Boo, and Sherry. Marcus, can I sit next to you? I love Christmas. You would, you would love if I sit next to you. Are you? I'm going to sit next to Sherry. As, as our judge who has done this in the years past, yep. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Um, I see you're drinking a lovely Coke. Yes, I do. Yes, and I see Craggy Boo has a lovely Coke, and then Sherry's the good one at the end over there. I saw her drinking water. You're hydrating yourself. He has a Coke with lime, okay? Oh, Coke and lime. He has a Coke and lime. It's a very different thing. Okay, okay. So, uh, Craggy, let me ask you this. The lights just came on. How are you feeling? Excited. I'm rather excited. I'm looking over yonder and I'm seeing a number of boats that look quite creative. I just can't wait for them to come a little bit closer so I can be all judgy. All judgy, all judgy. Uh, Sherry, are you ready? Are you going to be the Simon and be the tough judge or are you going to be the easy judge? I'm going to be the easy judge, but like Craig, I'm going to be judgy. We're all going to be a little bit judgy. Of course, Sherry, welcome. We want to say a big thank you. Uh, to you and Cayman National for being our title sponsor. Let's talk about these boats, you guys. Most definitely. They're starting to make their way around, so we're going to actually start the competition right now. And as they make their way around to folks, we want you to give them a round of applause. They've really worked hard to put together all of these lights on the boat, and they definitely want to feel special about it tonight. They're all winners. We want to acknowledge that, but we're going to get started right now, Taylor. We are. We're going to talk about our first boat. Our first boat is Rockaways. And uh, Captain Ryan is at the helm of this. Look at how beautiful that is. All the flashing lights that they're waving around. Blue is my favorite color, so I like to see a lot of blue. How do you, what do you think so far, Marcus? I love blue. I love the surprise. It's amazing. Craggy Boo, what you thinking? I think whoever is the captain of that boat is rather smart because it's the Cayman National Colors. Uh, because it's sponsored by Cayman National. Uh, look at good Sherry. Job, good Sherry's job. like, uh huh, sure is. Uh, this is uh, this is one of the boats that CNB had put in to be in the parade, so that's why we see the blue and white on it. Sherry, what made you put some boats in? You just thought, hey, why not? This is our event. We might as well. Yeah, of course. And we have a lot of boat captains bank and work at King <laughs> National, so why not? Why not? Definitely indeed. All right, let's give it up for Rockaways, a boat number one. This is in the large, bar large, large boat category. As Amazing. you guys know, we do have two boat categories tonight. Our large boats are 31 feet and larger. Our small boats are 30 and under, and we're going to have two winners tonight. 
each of those winners is going to walk away with two thousand dollars wow this is a nice christmas bonus isn't it a great christmas bonus yes indeed you can buy some christmas presents or donate it to a good cause you can craigie boo if you got two grand what would you do with it i think i'd buy booze for one point Booze for Rum Point. Okay, well, I got that. Oh, Give it up God. for Craigie Boo, man. <laughs> All right. All right, our next boat that's coming up, boat number two. Please give a round of applause for Caribbean Explorer. Their time, Candyland, that's the name of their team. Now, this boat is very special. There's a lot of young kids that's actually taking the time to design this boat. And let me tell you a story about what these kids want to do. If they win tonight, they're actually taking their money and going to a youth to youth conference in New Orleans. So they're actually spending the money to go away and build the brains up a little bit. All right, so give them a round of applause. It's a beautiful design. It's titled Candyland. And of course, Mr. Lynn McLaughlin is the captain. 25 people are on board. And They've Craig, did you know that the kids on board are all from John Gray and Clifton Hunter? Please give them a round of applause, all man. All the kids, yep. Now, they actually started the design. They said they started this in October, but they actually told me something. They said they wanted to start it in October, but they've been working on this today. They actually got this done today. That's a, Yeah, because they, they, the boat was out for charters today. So even though they knew what they wanted to do, they actually had to make sure it was all done today after the charters happened. Absolutely. And they got to take everything down tonight also because they got to get ready for a charter tomorrow. They sure do. And uh, this year makes three years of this boat in the parade correct correct now guys what are you thinking when you see this boat sherry what do you think um very creative the fact that the kids actually decorated it oh man that just melts my heart it is it's all about the kids they were on there working hard there's this one little boy that's on there who tried to give me little like sweet eyes i said honey i'm just hosting i'm not the judge <laughs> Yeah, he was trying to make sure he got his vote in by thinking he thought we were one of the judges and he wanted to kind of sweet lip us a little bit. I, I think it almost you worked right. too. It was, it was. So let's give it up one more time for them and all the kids on board that uh, decorated that all today. All today. Uh, Marcus, are you excited for the next one? Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Are you excited um, in your judging or are you being a tough judge? I think creativity, unusual behaviors, and beautiful, crazy lightning makes a difference. Oh, I like that. I believe when people on the boat dress up, I think when people dance, when people make noise, and everybody in the audience is excited, makes it special. I like that. All right. So let's hear it for boat number three. Are you ready to judge, guys? Boat number, number three is the Cayman Island Sailing Club, Sweet Delight. Looks beautiful, too. Look at that. It's a Good solid job. up. This is a, a party barge, and their theme is treats. Boat captain, Peter Adams. There are eight people aboard, and look at you. got a Caribbean Santa up front. Look at all the people having a great time. That looks like a party barge that I would want to be under. Craig? What I think uh, when this is all said and done, you and your Christmas get up need to go take a photo in all of those lights. What do you think? So I think my Christmas tree earrings belong on that boat. I think you're right. Your Christmas tree earrings would, you know, they've got two little Christmas trees at the front. So yours would make four. Mine would make four. As soon as I'm through here, I'm going to go join the crew. All right, you got a tough job ahead of you guys, a tough job. Oh uh, man, Shari, what are you thinking when you see this boat here? It's beautifully done, they're excited. I even see Santa in the front. What are your thoughts? Beautiful, use of color, creativity. I, I, I'm really liking this boat. Perfect, so the uh, Cayman Islands Sailing Club, they actually started planning this the end of November and they have been participating since the Parade of Lights began. So they have uh, been, you know, doing this for many, many years now. And they say their inspiration is just the Christmas fun, the this, this season, just having a good time and putting all the lights together. Absolutely. Let's give a round of applause to boat number four. They've got over 1,000 lights on yes, that Yes, man. Boat. This one is called the Big Blue. It's actually yes. the team is Frozen. Oh, amazing. Look at that. Now, Creativity. They Look at that. <laughs> it just got a little chilly in here. It, just did. it did. It did. This Are is a wonderful design. Anna? 
frozen in the Caribbean. Here we go. <laughs> and they capture they capture the scenery very well. They started this a week ago, and it's actually you can tell the team the movie's out right now. It's frozen and it looks beautiful. Sherry, what are you thinking what when is? you see this boat? It is awesome. The blue again came in national colors. You're gonna get some extra points just for that. <laughs> they did and a if, wonderful job, man. And if you take notes, kids, you can actually see Elsa and Anna are on the boat. They handmade all of their decorations this year. Everything you guys is rocked the world! Yes! Marcus gave a lot of points right there. <laughs> And he said, he said this is, uh, he's doing this again. He tried it last year and his generator failed. So this is his attempt to do it again. And round of applause, guys. You're doing a great job. Generator is still going, too. That's boat number four. Taylor, who do we have coming up next? But boat five is called Lost Boys 2. Um, the theme is a gingerbread sleigh. This is Jane Peck. She is the uh, captain today. She's got three people on board with her. And uh, she says she wants everyone to know they might be a small boat, but they sure are mighty and have the Christmas spirit. They said that they pulled this all together within 20 hours. They started planning months ago, and they would have meetings together about what they wanted to do. But they executed it in, uh, in 20 hours. And this is their second year being in the Parade of Lights. And their inspiration behind this was the sleigh in the movie Elf. You, look, you know what? If you look really close, as soon as he turns around, you will see that Santa is actually on that boat. Santa! Wonderful I job. I him! I think he has a little helper on the side, too. Now, we want to get the reviews from the judges just to get, like, little thoughts on what you guys think as it makes its way closer here over here. This is absolutely amazing. Hello, Santa! Only in the Cayman Come Islands. Come on, everybody wave. We got Santa! Only in the Cayman Islands does Santa arrive by Boston Whaler. Yes! <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Sherry, there's some blue on there for Cayman National. What are you thinking about this one? Dane, do you want to give her your... Yeah. Awesome. Um, love the creativity. Love Santa and the reindeers on the water. Very creative. I was distracted there for a moment. It's really, it they really, like shiny actually, things. yeah, they actually done a really good job. Can we just give them a round of applause? Like, like this, such a small boat, but they managed to fit so many lights on there and a wonderful design. And they have the blue in there for Cayman National Bank. Everybody's going along with that theme. That is boat number five. Give them a round of applause again, please. And like they said, they may be small, but they are mighty. And what they make, uh, what they lack in size, they make up in spirit. You know that's true. What what you like? In Jamaica we call that talawa. Talawa? Yeah, we have a saying in Jamaica that says little but we talawa. Little but talawa. There we go. Excellent. I'm I'm learning. I'm learning. Sherry, how are you doing down there? Are you enjoying? Are you are you having a hard time picking your favorite so far? Um no. I, I'm, I have some eyes on some front runners, but I'm, I'm eager to see what else is coming down. All right. And, and we got some big things coming down the corner. Boat number six. This one is titled Candy Land. It's real affair right here. Three generations on this boat. Granddad. Three generations? That's right. Three generations on this boat, man. And they've done a wonderful job. The team is Candy Land. They've been working hard to get this done. Now, it's, it's really not their first time. They've actually taken part in this, but done it to this extent, this big. This is their first time doing something like this, man. This is, this is insane, Taylor. That is looks amazing. beautiful. I'm pretty sure Santa can see that from the North Pole. He can. He's definitely, anyone can see that up above. Now, I want to get some reviews from the judges. This one is a pretty big one, and there's a lot of things that are on this boat. What strikes you? Let's start with Craig. Candy canes. Yeah. <laughs> the biggest candy canes in the Cayman Islands. Marcus, you know Look what? Look at it. They well, actually hand made those. They said they're made out of PVC pipes, and when Dane and I were talking to them earlier, they said they handmade those, and they even b had to burn the pipes to make the art of the candy cane. You know, Taylor, it is quite amazing to see the use of the outriggers. With bigger boats, it gives you the opportunity to take advantage of those outriggers, and that's exactly what they did. Congratulations to them. Well done. Yeah? You know what an outrigger is? Most definitely. Okay, so fine. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so they, they have been uh, at this for quite a while, and like 
Dane said there are three generations on that boat and Co uh, Captain Alex Dilbert was excited that he's got three generations on that boat and this is their first time doing the, uh, the Cayman National Parade of Lights here in Kamana Bay. I think they definitely need to come back. That is a, an amazing job. They did an amazing job. Let's give a round of applause, please. Let's yes. make them feel special tonight. Put your tonight. hands together. Hello. Look at Marcus Hello. is up and at him. Marcus is up and at him. Hey, it's all about handy cases. They also said that they're in. <laughs> you can. They also said their inspiration uh, on this was their first, firstborn son Sebastian. He's the light of their lives. And they've got all those lights on there just to prove it. Great job. Amazing job. What do we have coming up next, Taylor? It's just uh, actually you can even see it peeking uh, out. It is. On the way, coming right around the bend there, you can see the changing lights. This is Adrenaline. This is boat number seven. Their theme is Christmas tree with a surprise. Let's see Look what the surprise is. Oh. That's the surprise. Look at that! Oh man, guys, what are you thinking right now? Let's start with Sherry. Oh man. I love the surprise. It's a giant candy cane Christmas tree. It, it is a beautiful representation of the theme. Treats. Oh, awesome job. Awesome job. Craig. You know what? I think the crowd needs to help me in uh, welcoming adrenaline. They're, they're doing a good job. Boat captain on hands this together, one. Hands together for adrenaline. Hands together, yes. Uh, the captain on this one is Captain Chick, Chip Ogilvie. And uh, he said he's done this seven years. He did miss last year, but he's excited to be back. The boat is sponsored by Corporate Electric, and he says he appreciates uh, their support. It took him about 30 hours to decorate this boat. 30 hours. That's a long time, isn't it, Marcus? Have you seen how high up the lights are? I would not. Just getting up to the top of the lights, it's scary. I would not want to be the one putting those up there. No, me neither, but that is awesome. Or the one taking them down. Yep. Leave wow. them on the boat. Look at how amazing that is. So they, uh, it took them, they wanted to take LED lighting to another level and put a cutting edge on the light show on the boat. And that is what they did. You saw when they were coming around that corner, they had all the colors changing and uh, it was solid colors. And now they go from candy cane and all over the place. Marcus, do you like it? Is it pretty? Is it shiny? Is it nice? It is lovely. It's impressive. It's unique. And it is absolutely stunning. All right. Now, are you enjoying yourself so far, guys? Are you enjoying yourself, Commander Bay? Make some noise! Oh, All right, man, that's boat number seven. Let's give them one more round of applause as they make their way out. This one that's coming up very soon. I haven't seen any lights making its way in yet, but I will go ahead, Taylor, and just get some more reviews from our judges of what they think so far of all the boats Craig that's passed Boo, in. Let's, let's, let's talk to you. You know, I'm rather impressed. I'm rather impressed. I see the hard work. I do see the creativity. The lights are quite amazing. And I would love for our patrons here at Kamana Bay to play a bigger role. I want to, are they still alive or is everybody sleeping? I don't know. Are you guys alive out there? Come on, a <laughs> I think they're just in awe of all the different lights that are happening. I think that's what it is. That's exactly what it is. Everybody's focused. There's a market street that's open. They're doing photo booths. They're seeing Santa. Yeah, There's a lot of treats. I know Marcus is one of the owners here of one of the restaurants here. They're probably over there He's eating. Got two, are you kidding? He's got two restaurants He's got two here. in here, right? So He's they're good. indulging a little bit. <laughs> He's all got right. two restaurants in Kamana Bay. We, we are seeing the next that boat about, almost yeah. around the corner here. We're going to wait a little bit more as they make their way but while what? i'm introducing them i got some good facts about this boat boat number eight is actually a christmas tree that's the title of it that's the theme of this boat they're the sea spirit they're owned by red sail sports now this is one of their new vessels it actually leaves here from Commander Bay exclusively, okay? Oh, so okay. you can actually catch the boat here. It's always stationed here. And there's nice also a next know. one at the Kipton, but this one is actually stationed and it's brand new. It's a family vessel. It's tons of things that you can do. They have so many different opportunities for you to book this boat and go out and explore Stingray City, snorkeling, different activities here on this island. So they have actually uh, placed themselves in the running. It's boat number eight. Let's give a round of applause to Red Sail Sports. All right. There it is. Look at that. Look at that. There we go. 
Look at all those candy canes. Look at the Christmas tree. Marcus, Marcus, what's your favorite part on this one? Candy cane. We love candy cane. Is that your favorite? Is yes. that your favorite candy? Yes, I love candy. What about the gingerbread? I'm liking that odd touch of, is that fuchsia or magenta? What color is that? I think right? it's magenta. Magenta, right. I love, of course, Craig, you would pick like the nice, pretty magenta color to like the most. Well, of course. I love the gingerbread. The, the gingerbread, yes, they're awesome. All right, Beautiful bowl. Let's give a round of applause again, please. Wonderful job done. And like we said, it's a new vessel, folks. It leaves here from Commander Bay. So if you ever want a book, there is a store located right next to, um, of course, Marcus, your restaurant. It's yeah. right next door to Abacus. So, and, and the nice Peru. thing is, and the nice thing also is that if you want to take this boat over to Rum Point, you can do the Rum Point run for uh, for dinner. So Absolutely, this one now, yes. they, this takes you rather than the sailboat that they used to do. They take you out on this. The trip is a little bit quicker. Yeah, that's right. Cut down the time from two hours. Yeah. So it's because the engine is a little bit faster, which Craig knows a lot about. Craig, Craig knows the engine. <laughs> no, you know, I'm not too familiar with the dinner at Rum Point. Rum Point is for a whole different purpose. <laughs> You'll see Craigie Boo there on uh, Sunday afternoon. Hence the name Rum Point. Rum Point. <laughs> Let's give a round of applause for boat number eight, Red Sails. <laughs> Wonderful job. Once again, that team, by the way, is Christmas treats, and boy, do they have a lot of treats on that boat, and they did a wonderful job. So we're definitely honored to see this boat and the great job that Red Sails has done. All right? And we want to take this time once more just quickly to thank some of our sponsors while we're waiting for the next boat to come through. We want to, of course, Sherry welcome and all of our staff at Cayman National for being our title sponsor. Sherry, honestly, thank you so much for coming on board with us. We're so glad to have you. It's been a great year, um, and we couldn't do it without you guys. And, and congratulations on 45 years. 45 years, yes. yes. We also want to say thank you to Kamana Bay, who is our location sponsor. We could not do this without them. Obviously, we need their, their harbor to do this. Uh, do you want to take a few, Dane? You want to Absolutely. All right, we also want to thank the Marshals. They played a very important role here tonight in making sure these boats were organized. So give it up for Pro Yacht. And also, uh, major sponsor once again, Bogle Insurance Brokers. Let's give them a round of applause. Also, Britt K. Your round of applause to Britt K. They're going to be doing the fireworks tonight. I am so excited about that, Taylor. It's going to be big, man. I love the fireworks on this island. Honestly, you just can't beat it. Most definitely. Also, one of our photo boot sponsors. Let's give a round of applause to CTHM Doctors Hospital. All right. And if you want to go check them out, uh, they are over on the walkway, uh, kind of down by uh, King's Head and that. And uh, Cayman National, you guys also have a photo booth up, don't you? Uh, uh, an igloo photo booth. Yes, we do have an igloo photo booth. That's Please amazing. be sure to stop by, take some photos, capture the memories. It's a great night. Why not? And it's uh, really awesome, too, because you guys have Santa's display. You yeah, it looks Santa's beautiful display. over there. Look All at right, this. Look at this what one, you guys. What do we have here? This is boat number nine. This is an, another one that is uh, sponsored, and uh, their boat's name is Awesome. And if you look on the front there, those lovely people in green, they are the reindeer. They're all a different reindeer, and Rudolph is up front there. Rudolph, I like that your nose is flashing. Hello. And Santa's coming down that chimney up there on top of the boat. Look at, do you see, Craggy Boo, how the top is the chimney? Uh, I do see it. I do see it. Rather creative. Uh, Rudolph, big up yourself. <laughs> also, Cindy Lou, who is on the boat. Uh, we're so excited to have this one on board. And look at all those beautiful reindeer having a good old time. Reindeer, are you having fun? We can yeah. hear them clearly, man. One, one of the things I want to highlight is that they're not competing in the competition, but they, they really just want to have a good time. They want to come out and chill and just The be reindeer festive. are having a good time, but look who's on the back of the boat. Who's it's that? The, the Grinch. Grinch. <laughs> the Grinch. We love the Grinch. The Grinch. Are you going to push him overboard? Can we push the Grinch over? We don't want him on here. Cindy Lulu, you oh, tell man. the Grinch who's boss. Good you job know, by these guys. K with that Cayman national flag flying in the back, if they were entered in this competition as participants, they may just have won. Well, well, they're they're not because they are sponsored by Cayman National. We're so thankful for that. They cannot that does win. Make sense. 
Yes, they cannot win, but that's why they're repping those flags. Santa is having a party on the up, on top of the chimney. The Grinch is, well, being the Grinch. Cindy Lou Who looking lovely in her overalls and all those lovely reindeer up top. Uh, amazing job, you guys. Amazing. We love it. Thank you, Awesome. Thank you so much. Great job. And I love this that is, they just took part just to take part. They, That's and wonderful. And this is their first time doing it as it well. It is their first time. They wanted to, to highlight that they're just there to spend time with the family, enjoy the festivities, and enjoy Commander Bay. That's why they do it. They're all family on that boat, which all is a family. really awesome thing. Craig, how are you doing? I'm doing awesome. No pun intended, right? Uh, no pun intended. No pun intended. We how got are you? I'm doing good, thanks for asking. How is everybody else in Kamada Bay? Kamada Bay, how are you guys? Oh, look what we have here. Look at this! Last minute addition, but a very beautiful boat. Taylor, why don't you go ahead and explain what we have here. This one is the Sheila J. Their theme is Christmas treats, and they have been working on this for a couple weeks now. Look at how, look at the little gingerbread house, the gingerbread men on there. It is so amazing to see all of the candies that are on there. They've got all different types. Look at that. They've got cakes, and they've got hard candies, and they've got candy canes. Icicles. They have ice icicles in Cayman. Can you match? <laughs> Marcus is, is blown. His mind is blown. Oh, very happy. Very happy. What is your favorite? Is that your favorite? Is it gingerbread or the icicles? That is very complicated, okay? I think ah. icicles, candy canes, Cayman Islands, warm weather, beautiful people, come on away, paradise, we're happy. We are very happy. Oh. Yes. Thank you very much. Craig, do you like the uh, gingerbread house that they've got on there? I do. Great use of color. Great use of color, absolutely. Sherry? Great use of color. Love the Christmas treats. It's actually giving me um, a little craving for a sweet tooth. Um, I could eat some gingerbread right now. It is lovely. I love that. I could definitely do some gingerbread, too. I, I agree with you. We need to fulfill our, our sweet tooth. Most definitely. They did a great job. Let's give it out one time, Commander Bay, for boat number 10. Let's make some noise, please. We are at the final boat now, Dane. This is the last one, boat number 11. It now, is. Now, I, I love what boat number 11 has done. This one is titled Little Blue. Now, they are they actually uh, have a tour company here on Island. It's, um, let me see if I can find the name here really quick. Crazy Crab. Crazy Crab. Now, he's done this numerous amount of years. He has 11,000 lights on this boat. If he wins the money tonight, Taylor, he told us earlier that he's going to donate it to the NCVO. He did. So, so if everything he wins, will go to the NCVO. That Wonderful money is job. going to the NCVO, the kids who need it, which is a fantastic thing to do. You know, we're giving away $2,000 to the winner of the big and small boat. And that could buy a lot of Christmas presents. Absolutely. But he's going to take that and donate it to the NCBO. That's right. Sherry, what do you think of that? That is very noble. Um, Cayman National actually has a long, long, long history with the NCBO. So again, I don't know if they know it, but that might just win them some extra points. Now, their theme is Christmas under the sea. Look at Santa is actually a crab. He's being pulled by the seahorse, and there's mermaid. A boat with mermaids on it, that just might be my favorite. We look at it, and they actually did all of the decorations themselves. They started building the boat and the decorations in August. That is a, uh, a long time to be planning something like this. And look at, I did, look at the crab, the arm is waving at us. Good job. Marcus, what do you think? Let's give him a round I of applause, please. I think it's creativity please. at its best. Very well done, guys. Very well done. ID, salt work, amazing. This is exactly what Cayman National Parade of Lights is all, is about. all about. That arm is going. And just in case you guys want to know what the judges are actually judging on, they're judging on wow factor. They're judging on creativity, the use of color, and the overall impression. Now, those are the ones that are going to, those are the categories the judges are being uh, really in tune with. Those mermaids flapping their tails. I love it. Will you guys give me some swim lessons later? Ah, uh, Marcus, yes. they're throwing you kisses. Uh, oh, they're for Craig. Well, they're they were for me, too. There's two mermaids. You both can have one. Both kisses from both mermaids were for me. Craig, stop being so selfish. It's a Christmas season. 
Yeah. Though, you know, you're right. It is Christmas and me sheer. I mean sheer. Marcus, Marcus, right. There well, we go. maybe, there maybe we go. they were all for Dane. I, you know I don't know. I don't know about that. <laughs> 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 Definitely for the guys, for sure. But listen, uh, while we are watching this beautiful boat, which is our last one, by the way, boat number 11, I want to thank the RCIPS Marine Unit. They've yes. been doing a wonderful job in patrolling the area and just making sure that everything around here is safe. And one thing we did forget about, Taylor, the island, the VIP members on the island over yes. there. Yes. Which is brought to you by Cayman National Bank also. Right. Yes. Sherry, so, do you know what? Is that your family and friends over there? Is that what it is? Um, it's, it's a combination of long-standing customers, some of our staff, it's, and I think some other sponsors are out there as well. That's amazing. It's a wonderful it's a, job. How's the island doing? Are you guys having fun? <laughs> I can't hear them at all. No, they're, 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 they're a little too far Make removed some noise. from us. All right, and again, thank you to Cayman National. It is the Cayman National Parade of Lights. So, overall thoughts, guys, what do you think? Absolutely amazing what the people put the effort in it. I think the lights get better every single year, and I think the people get in the spirit of Christmas. We got thousands of people here at Kamana Bay, and everybody loves the occasion, loves the music, loves the choir. And honest to God, I'm not here to help you out, but God, I love CMB for helping out. It is an amazing event bringing people together. It absolutely is. Craig Boo? What would Cayman Christmas be, Taylor, without the Cayman National Parade of Lights? A big round of applause to everyone who came out this evening to attend. And also, a big round of applause to Cayman National. Yes, we couldn't and have done it without them. Unless we forget, Hurley's Media. Oh, well, of course, Hurley's Media. We've got all of our staff uh, making sure everything is going smooth. So thank you to the Hurley's Media staff. Uh, Craigie Boo, we'll hear you uh, Monday on Irene. Right and early from 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. Big up yourself. Now, Shari, you, you actually sponsored this for the first time. You're the title sponsor. This is a big deal for you. What are your thoughts right now? Are you saying this was a wonderful idea? Great idea. Um, like I said, it, we've been celebrating 45 years. What better way to celebrate 45 years than to share it with the community at large? And, you know, we have a huge history, the Cayman Islands, of maritime. Um, and so just being on the water, having a nice spectacle, a nice, nice evening, family filled. It, it just, it's an awesome time and Most great definitely. way to kick off the Christmas season. Most definitely. You can definitely feel the Christmas breeze here. You can feel the festivities. You can feel that it is, it is a finally Christmas. I think we're at 18 or, or 19 days left for Christmas. Is that all correct. it is? That's yeah. crazy. It's close, man. It's very Marcus, close. Marcus, have you started your Christmas shopping? Yes. Unfortunately, I had no choice. <laughs> Craigie, have you? Most definitely. And Sherry, how about you? No. I love that the one female is the one who has not started the Christmas shopping yet. Uh, Dane, how about you? I have started. I'm almost done. I would say like I'm 90% done. Okay, so I'm, I'm, done. I'm in the same group with Sherry. I haven't started either. I love the, the feel. We'll, we'll wait. We'll wait. That's okay. That's the, the most important. We have a strategy behind it, right, Taylor? Of course. Yes, you, know. you know, I like a little bit of panic in my Christmas shopping exactly. because then I can uh, focus a focus. little bit better, right? Yeah, sure. That's it. That's it. I might have to come into CMB and get a loan out for some of these presents <laughs> yeah. that I want to buy, though. I'm just saying. All right, let's make sure that everybody in Commander Bay is still alive and well and excited. Make some noise. Don't forget, we still have the fireworks left. And we're going to be announcing the winners very soon. We have our own studio audience, a steel band from UCCI. Can you guys make some noise, please? I think they're louder than everybody in Commander Bay, which is good. We, uh, we are bringing the boats back in. In case you didn't get enough of them, we want to make sure that you get an, another uh, intake of all the loveliness that is the boats. Marcus, are you ready? Yes, I am. And I would love to say something. I would love to thank Randy Merrin. And I don't know about this, for the last five years, the Parade of Lights has been here at Kamana Bay. And Modi talks about Randy. Randy always thought it's very important to have this parade here. And it brings thousands of people together, brings a choir together, kids playing music, dancing, the boats. Randy, thank you. And it means a lot to everybody here at Kamana Bay. It brings a lot of people from Cayman Islands around it. Randy, if you hear us, Thank you very, very much. Can we hear it for Randy Marion? 
And save us, Whoa. and save us one of those uh, Scotch bonnet shots too, Randy. Right? Yes, see me. <laughs> Put a little Christmas spirit in us. Here they come again, guys. The boats are on their way back through the harbor here in Kamana Bay. The judges are going to go a little bit closer to the water to get a little bit better of a view. Zane, I have to say this has been a, a great night. This is your first parade of lights. You've now the seen one. the boats. What do you think? It's beautiful. Listen, I couldn't have picked a, a better hosting gig to do tonight, especially just before Christmas. I'm loving it. I'm loving the people. I'm loving the boats. And I'm loving the, the judges. We, we're around good company. We're really around good company. <laughs> I love Marcus is having a great time back here as we're looking at all these wonderful boats. All right, everybody, let's cheer the boats on, please. Thank you to DJ Mars, who is supplying the soundtrack for us right now. Look at the boats. I literally have goosebumps, literally have chills from such an amazing feeling in Kamana Bay right now. Thane's in awe for his first ever Parade of Lights. Craigie Boo is double checking his scores and making sure that he has them all right. Marcus and Sherry are enjoying a moment as we watch the 2019 Cayman National Parade of Lights boats one more time. Marcus is showing us his dance moves. I like that. Just Coke. Just Coke. We've got these amazing trophies here. Look at those beautiful trophies, Craigie Boo. They're heavy. They're they're crystal. We want to thank our sponsors one more time. Of course, we've said it a million times, but Cayman yeah. National, thank you so much for being our title sponsor. Kamana Bay for providing this beautiful location. I love the big Christmas tree. I love all the palm trees lit up, the strings of light. It is uh, just such a great feeling here in Kamana Bay. Thank you to Pro Yacht for being our Marshall sponsor. Thanks. And of course, we want to thank Bogle Insurance Brokers. They're a major sponsor tonight also. So let's give them a round of applause too. And of course, CTHM Doctors Hospital. They did a photo booth sponsorship. So please take the time to go to the Market Street along with Cayman National Bank and take some photos, man. Capture the moments and the festivities that have been held here. They're just beside, King, just beside King he King's Head if you want to go over and, and do the photo booth. Perfect. Uh, what's that? Next to also the restaurant that's next door. Down by Agua. Agua, correct. Yeah. So you can stop by there for the families that want to take some pictures just before the fireworks start. And talking about fireworks, Brick K sponsored the fireworks today, tonight, man. You will be seeing that very soon. So we're going to be preparing for that very soon. And a special thank you to the RCIPS Marine Unit for keeping this whole area safe tonight, man. And the police force and commander base security um, officers also. They're not in here, but I feel they're definitely need. I, I did see tonight. plenty of the officers kind of walking around uh, before it all got started. They looked like they were all ready to take on the Christmas spirit. Peggy Boo? May I just add that the Cayman, uh, the commander Bay security officers should be considered parking professionals. That's for sure. Uh, and you guys, you have to go visit Santa Sleigh. If you have not yet seen Santa Sleigh, it is amazing. It is so pristine. Cayman National brought it in. It's down by the uh, Cayman National Roundabout, down by the bank. Go check it out. Get your photos taken in it. It is a great photo op for families. Or if you're just a big kid, or you know, maybe Craigie Boo, maybe we should go take our photo in Santa Slay. What do you think? I'm down. All right, we'll do it. It's you and me and Dave. I'm ready. We'll do a Hurley's Media.
photo in the sleigh with everyone who's behind the scenes and all of that too. Go team Hurley's media. Sherry, you are part of the Hurley's media team. Do you not know that yet? You need to be you need to be in that definitely. Marcus, you are always in trouble. Oh yeah, always Marcus, in you're invited too. They are all from UCCI. Yeah, they're all students at UCCI. They play the drums and me sing, and they're amazing. Can you say hello? Hello, UCCI. It's, well, Marcus, did you miss it? You didn't miss their performance, did you? It was fantastic. They're the pandemics. Never, never, never. But I didn't do that all at UCCI. And UCCI is very close and dear to my heart. And I like all of them. And some will do engineering, some sociology, some computers. He does a weird stuff up there, so that's okay. They rock the world, and they are the future of K-Man. I love you guys. You guys are awesome. A big round Let's of applause for you, CCI. And we want to give it up for all of our performers tonight. First Baptist Choir. We had the UCCI Pandemics we were just talking about. Dream Chasers. We had Centerpoint Dance Studio and VJ Mars from Z99. And Irie is here. She is playing the tune. She's going to continue to play tunes all night long. So if you want to stick around and dance and just enjoy the ambiance that is here in Kamana Bay, you definitely can do that. Most definitely. And as we, uh, we have some of our behind the scenes workers tallying up these votes, we're getting ready to announce the winners very soon. Are you guys excited? Yes. yes. I'm loving that they're all coming back through. We get to see them one more time. Take in all of the lights. I still am amazed at how many lights that tiny little boat has on it. Indeed. Indeed, Taylor. Indeed. I'm still in awe also, Craigie Boo, of your Christmas tree light or your Christmas tree earring. Have you been checking my earrings out? I've been checking them out. So I mentioned it earlier, Taylor, that Kamana Bay for the first time has three Christmas trees. Yes. The big one, yes, and then one on my right earlobe and the other on my left. You know, it has never been so Christmassy. It's never in been so Christmassy, Marcus. What do you think? I'm speechless. I got. I'm not saying anything anymore. I'm of course, we have to thank our judges one more time. Uh, they're the ones who are going to be helping us decide which boats are the winning boats. We've got Sherry Welcome, who is Cayman National Bank Marketing and Communications Manager. We got Craig who everyone knows from Hurley's Media, uh, the morning show host, and Irie. And of course, Marcus, you don't, need an, you don't need anyone to tell anyone who you are because you are right here uh, in, in Kamada Bay all the time. He's owner of Carew, Abacus, and Deckers. Oh, you don't want people to know? No, no, no. Why? I don't know, it's Christmas. What, what does that matter? Moving on. <laughs> Moving on, all right. And a big thank you to all of our uh, our lovely Hurley's media staff for helping out and doing the tallies. And thank you to all of the boats who decorated, spent all their time and hard work to make sure that everyone had a lovely, festive Cayman National Parade of Light. Dane, Man, we're, not, just, we're not judging, so not. I'm going to talk to you for a quick sec. Please. Which one was your favorite? Oh, man, that's a very difficult one to ask. Um, I mean, it, it's easy to, to touch my heart when you when you mention anything that has to do with kids and then you're going to take money instead of using it for yourself and just donate it to a great cause. Yeah. I would have to say that was actually my favorite, which is Crazy Crab, Little Blue. Yeah. So it actually touched me a bit. Candyland, Tree Generations, I'm all about family also. Yeah. So them coming together and actually putting together a nice boat like that. And the lights on the boat, sorry, and, right. and making that work. That was wonderful. And we had the uh, the kids that will be traveling for Youth to Youth uh, conference very soon. And, and they had a boat that was done. Oh, Frozen. It's we can't, frozen. We can't forget Frozen here. also. I know. I love the Frozen boat. I love that Elsa and Anna are here. Hi, Elsa and Anna. And Olaf is on the boat. What's the reindeer's name? I can't remember. Nobody remembers. Do you guys know? Do you guys know what the reindeer's reindeer. name is? Nobody Scream knows the reindeer. I hear, I hear some kids yelling it. I can't, I can't, I can't tell. I can't, I can't quite hear but it. I wonder Frozen, if my mic can work Frozen if I had on Frozen 2 over in cinema now uh, at the Command Bay Cinema. So if you're in the holiday spirit and you got kids or you're like me and you just love Disney, you can go ahead and uh, and go see Frozen 2. You should know the name, Marcus. How many you times have you watched Frozen? How many times have you watched Frozen? Times? No. Your son has watched three times. <laughs> <laughs> I love the camaraderie we here have we have here on the judges table. Everyone's in such a good mood, having a great time, and we hope everyone out there is having fun as well and enjoying the lights. The VIP Island, are you guys doing good out there? Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Look at the 
the moon. Can, you, can we look up and look at that moon right now? It's amazing. We're so close to having those fireworks as well. Thank you, Britt K, for being our fireworks sponsor. It's not a true Cayman event unless we have fireworks. You know that, right? One last round of the boats coming around and showing off. It is amazing. DJ Mars playing the Christmas music. The big Kamana Bay Christmas tree behind us. We do want to say thank you to Tim Bradley, Paul Lakeman, and Jay Dawson. Da I'm sorry, Dawkins who are our uh, parade marshals. Thank you to Pro Yacht for that. You didn't know that Craigie Boo was a performer as well, did you? Just wait until he starts dancing. All right, Dane, so your first Parade of Lights, the, Can the Cayman National Parade of Lights. This is your first one. Even though you were born and raised in Cayman. Please, uh, listen, I'm, I'm still ashamed of myself for not coming, but. <laughs> you should be, I'm not gonna I've lie, you should I've be. I've made it, and you know what? I tempted to come last year, but you could not find any parking anywhere. That's when you just make it happen. You I just know, make right? it work. You just you put your car somewhere. somewhere. Yeah, I just didn't make it work but that Dean, time. But I'm, I'm happy I'm here, though. That is the sign of a very good event when you can't find parking. Exactly, exactly. And we know that every year around they do an awesome job. Like Marcus said earlier, we, we, we have to continue to thank the people that came up with this idea, especially people like Randy that's been committed to it for years. Most definitely, most definitely. And, and now we, we have Kim and National Bank, which I'm pretty sure, I'm 100% sure, I don't want to put her on the spot, but I'm 100% sure she's going to be yeah. title sponsor next year too. Uh, <laughs> pretty, uh, sure. Pretty, pretty sure. Pretty sure. Yes. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. I do pretty to, sure. I do have to say, um, when I moved to this island six years ago, one of my very first things I did with Hurley's Media was to be in your in your spot. I was one of the judges uh, for the Parade of Lights back in uh, 2014, and I still talk about it to this day because if people haven't been to Cayman during Christmas, they don't understand it. You, they don't get, you know, you've got the, the roundabouts that are lit up. You've got Kamana Bay lit up. We've got the Christmas breeze that brings in that Christmas spirit for us. And the Cayman National Parade of Lights just makes it a, the, the Christmas, you know you're ready for Christmas when we have the Parade of Lights. So I feel like, I feel very honored to be hosting Dane with you and to be sitting here with you judges. Uh, this is my sixth one, and it is it just gets better every year. And being in this spot, and knowing what you guys just had to do, judging these boats, it is hard. It is very hard. Sherry, what was the hardest thing for you? Why don't you take that mic? Tell us the hardest thing about judging. Um, Craig kept looking at my paper. Um, the Craig was cheating? <laughs> was to, to hide my score from Craig. Craig, there's no cheating. No, it wasn't quite cheating. I was just uh, looking for reference. <laughs> All righty. So I'm going to do... I'm going to add these up. Are we ready for me to add these up, you guys? I don't Absolutely. want the judges to know who's the winner. I want the judges to be surprised. So I'm gonna Would you like up. a calculator, Taylor? So you guys, uh, you guys talk amongst yourself while I'm uh, doing the tallying here, okay? Well, I chose you to, okay, you, perfect. They accounted in the team. This like boat us. here, Dane, definitely provided the most to look at. So There's some good. features just, just on the top deck there. I, I see some reindeers, I see a sleigh. Those huge candy canes that made Marcus get a bit excited. 
They made those themselves. They made those themselves. And in the background, we see that lovely Christmas tree, well adorned with all those LED lights. Wow. And it, look, it looks like it has like different colors, not just one that's stationary at all times. There's different ones. Look, we saw earlier red and the white, the candy cane. This is switched up a bit. This is really Christmas colors here. It's also one of my favorites. I forgot about this, but uh, this was also one of my favorites. So. Now, Dane, one of the criteria we're using to judge was the wow factor. And I think Absolutely. this boat coming down the canal here definitely has it. Most definitely. Uh, I've seen a lot that gave a lot of wow factors tonight, but this one was one of them. And of course, Red Sails. Red Sails did an amazing job too. I most definitely, thank you. most definitely. Having it, having to be the one adding these up and uh, finding out which one. This is close, you guys. This is really, really close. Are we, near, are we near to it, Taylor? Are we, are we, are we almost there? Uh, we're almost there. We're almost there. We've got some more boats that we want to bring in and make sure everyone sees. <laughs> everyone sees for one more time. We've got a few more boats that are on their way in right now. Kaleidoscopic Christmas tree. Yes. VJ Mars playing the music. A very special evening to VJ Mars. Hi. She's also from Hurley's Media. She and is. she also does have a show on Irie as well. Does she? She does. She has an afternoon drive every weekday. I mean, she plays more than Christmas music then. <laughs> yes. And she actually hosted with you the other week. Uh, she was in, in the mornings with you as well. For Isn't a she while. lucky? Uh, Isn't she lucky? Uh, <laughs> Congratulations to DJ Marge, man, killing it. And, and of course, she's going to be playing more music after the event is completed, after we see the fireworks. A great chance for you guys to just stick around, enjoy Kamada Bay, and enjoy the festivities. Take some photos, go and see Santa while the boats are still making their way in. This is a great time before we announce the winners, whether you buy the market space or by CNB area. You're taking photos, you're going to see Santa to wrap it up, and uh, head back down so we can announce the winners. I think Taylor is almost done. And we are also almost. live. There's a lot of cameras that are around, so we are live. So don't forget, if you see a camera placed on you, just give him a little wave and a smile, okay? But Parade of Lights 2019, a next successful year. Can we give all the boats a round of applause again, Commander Bay? Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. Hard now hear the angels sing, a new king born today. And man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Trumpet sound and angels sing, listen to what they say, that man will live forevermore because of Christmas. charter to Stingray City and Starfish Point. You can also take it to um, Rum Point for their dinner cruise. Take it out, have dinner at Rum Point Club, and then take the boat back, which is always amazing. The stars are out, you're sitting on that boat on that top, you know, if you're on that top deck, it's a magical experience. Definitely want to let you know, too, while you're taking it out to Rum Point, they actually cut down the time that takes you takes you to get up there and to come back down. It's actually gone down because they've actually got a faster boat now. That's a speed so, demon. yes, and it leaves from here, Kamada Bay, two locations here and the Kipton Seafire Resort, all right? Yep, and they do private charters, in, or uh, I'm sorry, public charters in the afternoon if you are interested. All right, I'm getting close to having these all tallied. Just as the boats are going by, we want to remind you, the, the 11 boats in this parade are being judged on creativity, color, their wow factor, and the overall impression. There are the 
those reindeers with those special shirts they've got with their names on it. Looking good, ladies, looking good. Did you guys get rid of the Grinch? Oh, he's still oh, there. He's still there. He's still there. Cindy Lou, who's trying to warm him up. Listen, listen, Mr. Grinch, if you don't be happy, we're gonna throw you in this water. And ain't nobody want that. Cindy Lou Who, give him a big kiss. Santa's up top in the chimney. Santa looks like he's lost a little weight. You need to put some weight on before Christmas, Santa. Look at that maneuvering back into their slip. Taylor, I think, I think we're wrapping up the boats now as they make their way back in. We we're down are. to the final we two are. that are going to make their way in, and we do want to cheer them on. They did a great job tonight. I don't think anybody lose, uh, leaves here a loser tonight. That's the thing. We've got to give a round of applause to all of the boats. I know we can only have one winner in each category, but honestly, they're all winners. They've done an amazing job. They've taken their hard time and energy, put it into planning the boats, creating it, making it happen. Right, Craigie Boo? I think you're absolutely correct, Taylor. Thank you very much, Craigie Boo. They're all winners this evening. I love how, how, how proper you are tonight. Is it the bow tie? Does the bow tie make you a little bit more proper? It is indeed the bow tie, Taylor. It is indeed the bow tie. Oh, Craigie. Oh, I love it. It is small, but it is mighty. And look at that beautiful boat, the gingerbread house, the gingerbread up front, all the candies and cakes. What was that word I taught you earlier, Taylor? I don't remember. Tell me again. Talawa. 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 Little, but with Talawa. Little, but with Talawa. Right. So that boat is little, but it sure is Talawa. So I can go to Jamaica and use that now? You are now partially Jamaican. Yes! <laughs> We have our last one here, Taylor making his way in, and this is the last one on the list. And of course, this is the one that they said they were gonna actually donate a lot of their funds to the NCVO. So Crazy Crab, Little Blue, as they make their way in, this is the final boat. We're tallying up the votes right now, and we're gonna get to a winner very soon. We we're are, we're just waiting for the Crazy Crab to come on yeah. in. The mermaid's still sitting up front. I think Craig wants to... Uh, have those uh, mermaids for his girlfriend for the holiday season. Is that right, Craggy Boo? Why would you put me on the spot like that, Taylor? I mean, you were saying they were sending kisses your way. That doesn't mean I necessarily um, need to date them, but uh, uh -oh. let me just send some kisses back. Give me a second. You, okay, you go send some kisses back to those mermaids. Sherry, are you enjoying being at the judges' table tonight? Are you enjoying the whole the whole process of the evening? It's a great experience. Um, I'm so honored to be a judge today. The the competition has been great. All right, Sherry, while you have that microphone, I have the official results. <gasps> and we would be honored if you from Cayman National would be the one to announce the winners. Would you like to do that for me? Yes. All right, the official ballots are done. All we right, let's, know who the winners are. Let's get the music Marcus, down a little bit. Marcus, do you want to come join us? Marcus has Marcus, to come back Marcus, before we announce it. Marcus, do you want to come it. join us? Marcus. No, come on. We're going to announce the winners. We want you here for that. I know you are, but we're, we're Sherry is about to announce the winners. Yes. All right. Let's do this. We are Can ready. Can we get a little drum roll? And the winner. And the winners are for the large boat category. Sea Spirit, the Red Sails boat. Give it up for Red Sails. Yay, Red Sails Red walks away with the large category. Congratulations to them. Another drum world Another for drum the roll. small boat category. Small boat category is the winner is Little Blue. Little Blue. Little Blue. Oh, man. And Little. they're actually front and center. There they are. They're it actually the, the last boat, boat that is in. Out in the harbor right now. And this is the boat that said if they won, they will be donating their $2,000 to the NCVO. How special is that? A round of applause for Little Blue. Little Blue and the mermaids, the crabs, the seahorse. Give all of the boats oh, yep, time for a mermaids. huge time round for the of mermaids. applause. 
When you talk about wow factor, good use of color, creativity, Little Blue has it. For the small boat category, Cayman National Parade of Lights 2019. Uh, hi, mermaids. Hi, mermaids. Oh, hi, crab. Hi, crab. Hi, crab. Uh, who else is on that boat? Do we see Santa there somewhere? All right, back, back to usual business. Hi, mermaids. <laughs> Hi, mermaids. Congratulations Hi. again to Little Blue. They are the small category winners and also Red Very Sales. Well Congratulations to Red Sales. Those are our two winners tonight, man. Congratulations, guys. Very well done. A special big up to that guy in the back that keeps the crab's arms moving. Wow. You are the real MVP. category right now little blue congratulations to little blue who's going to be donating their money to the ncvo let's give them a huge round of applause absolutely and making their way around right now just as we can see is red sales the large category winner goes to red sales sports don't forget you can catch them here in Kamata bay and they leave directly from here for all your stingray uh, stingray city visits rum stingray, point yes starfish point they'll take you to rum point for dinner are you guys having fun i want to hear you that was you guys i feel like we should be in a bigger christmas spirit right now are you having fun fireworks are on the way absolutely don't forget we are looking for the craziest audience i got some money i want to give away to the craziest audience let's make some noise in commander bay right now please Listen, we, we want to thank you guys. We know today has been a long time. Some of you guys have been out here from 4 p.m., all right? So we want to honor you for that, for showing up. It's been a long night. We know you enjoy the festivities that's been here in Commander Bay. The boats did a wonderful job. Just so everybody can feel special that's out there right now, can you please, just for 10 seconds, make as much noise as possible as I count you down? So 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Get louder. Come on, get louder. Amazing, Commander Bay. Let's start the fireworks. Who's ready for fireworks? Let's go. Does your heart hold the magic of the holidays? Is it filled with warm memories just waiting to be discovered again? Well, now is the time to open your heart. Believe in that magic and remember those treasured moments. Oh, they're still there, deep within you, waiting to touch you once more. So come along as the magic of the season leads the way.
down Santa Claus, near down Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Fixing and fixing and all his reindeers pulling on the rain. Bells are ringing, children singing, all is merry and bright. So hang your stockings and say your prayers, cause Santa Claus comes tonight. Here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. He's got a bag that's filled with toys for boys and girls again. I don't want a lot for Christmas. There is just one thing I need. I don't care about the presents underneath the Christmas tree. I just want you for my own. More than you could ever know. Make my wish come true.
you all for coming out. We want to say a huge thank you again to all of the boats that participated. We want to say a big congratulations to the Crazy Crab and Red Sail, our winners of the evening. Most definitely. Give them a round of applause again to our contestants that won Red Sails and Crazy Crab. Make some noise, please. Thank you to our judges who had the hard job of coming up with the winners. Thank you to the Hurley's media staff for all of their hard work. Thank you to you guys for coming out. And of course, we have to thank our sponsors one more time. Cayman National, you guys have been amazing. Sherry, thank you for being a judge. Kamana Bay, Pro Yacht, Bogle Insurance, uh, CTHM, Doctors Hospital, Britt K. Thank you to the RCIPS, the Marine Unit for patrolling the harbor. It was a wonderful night. DJ Mars is going to be playing the tunes if you want to stick around. Again, my name is Taylor Vaughn from Bob FM. Absolutely. And my name is ba Dane from Bob FM, Hurley's Media. We love you all. Be safe. Drive home safe and hang around. Have some fun. It's Christmas season. Dane, it was lovely hosting with you tonight. Thank you so much. You guys, very Merry Christmas to you all. Have a good night. Happy New to sing Santa's favorite Christmas song of all. You know the one about the jingling bells riding through the snow? Yes, that's the one.